Hello all, my name is Krish Nayak and uh, welcome to my YouTube channel. So guys, from past six to seven months, you'll be seeing that generative AI, you know, the market is becoming much more bigger. Companies are looking to develop solutions by with the help of LLM models, LIM models. And uh, the reason is very simple. You will be able to develop the application very much quickly. You will be able to harness the power of this large language models, large image models, and even multi-models to develop amazing application. Only problem that actually exist, you know, is regarding inferencing. And for that also many companies, many cloud platforms, they are coming up with good inferencing power technologies. And with the help of that, you are able to develop the application very much quickly. Not only that, you have vector databases to make sure that you efficiently store all the vectors with respect to any kind of text and all. So this kind of work is basically happening a lot from past six to six, seven months. And one more amazing thing that I'm actually seeing in this particular market is that you are also able to get a lot of freelancing work. From past six months, I have got a lot of messages from many people, you know. Uh, they just followed my specific playlist with respect to generative AI. Um, let's say with respect to Google Gemini Pro models, with respect to vector databases, with respect to Langchain. And after learning them, they are able to develop applications. They are able to showcase that particular work to the entire people out there in the, in the LinkedIn itself. And LinkedIn is one of the platform that many people had actually mentioned. And because of that, many, many people, many, many companies are coming to them and asking, hey, can you probably act as a consultant and probably solve this kind of problem statements? And this is what has happened. I've spoken to two to three people of my subscribers. One of the success stories I have already uh, mentioned in my LinkedIn platform. Now, so people are able to do some amazing work with respect to the applications over there and they are able to develop this kind of application, they are able to solve the problem. And parallelly with respect to freelancing, they are able to earn money. One person has completely switched into freelancing work where he has a dedicated client, right? And he's able to serve this. So in this video, I will be talking about if you are really interested in this particular work of freelancing, what all things you really need to do specifically for in the field of generative AI because see freelancing has it's not very easy there is a lot of hard work that is specifically involved it is not like in the first day you will be successful you definitely have to work really really hard you need to have all the knowledge with respect to data science projects building you need to have the knowledge of cloud you need to have the knowledge of ML ops you need to have uh, knowledge of CI CD pipelines how do you probably develop a complete ML project application but recently you'll be able to see that yes more generative AI kind of projects is also coming up um, I last month I will say you like uh, three companies right uh, uh, two companies were from foreign country one was from an European uh, European country over there in Switzerland and that person was asking me hey can you probably you know they have an e-commerce website they have where they have multiple catalogs and they really want to create a chatbot specifically for their use case where they are able to display the products where they are able to provide the suggestion with respect to the products to the end customer right and there they had to probably use vector databases and they wanted to implement it with the help of llm models obviously i did not have time for that but i made sure that i gave some of the references to them so that they can get their project developed i knew some of the people who are already working in the field of generative ai uh, who are also following my channel so i gave them that specific opportunities so in short the main aim of this particular video is just to make you understand if you also are looking for this kind of work what all things or what should be the roadmap that you should really follow okay now one and the most simple thing is that yes please make sure that you learn machine learning deep learning nlp you really need to be good at python programming language from basics i'll not say that go ahead and skip all these things and start something from advanced stages no that will not work at all you really need to start from the basic part because of that your fundamentals will be very very strong you need to focus more on developing projects in such a way that you know the entire life cycle of developing those projects itself right you need to probably know all the open source tools that are probably there in the market and most of the tools are open source you just need to probably use them develop that entire pro project or application over there only the part that will probably come uh, that will require some amount of money is with respect to deployments right but obviously when you're working for some kind of client or some kind of uh, um, you know if you're developing some application for someone right as a freelancer or as a consultant you will be seeing that uh, you will be able to give this specific work or you'll be able to take the entire cloud charges from them itself and uh, 
the best part will be that you will be getting a specific timeline and you may get multiple works as soon as you probably get one completed right and that is what you'll be seeing the frequency yes initially it will be tough so there is no such shortcut you really need to start everything from basics get a good hold of that try to have a good business knowledge about the use cases that you're solving you also need to have knowledge with respect to what kind of use case that you're solving right you need to understand the entire life cycle of a project itself now once you do this and which is which is what many people are specifically doing they're learning things and they're making sure that uh, you know they keep on getting upskilled with respect to the new things that are coming now the other thing is that you really need to share your knowledge in front of everyone linkedin platform is there github is there whatever things whatever projects that you develop in your learning process you need to share them see i usually get a lot of messages from so many people it may be directors it may be managers it may be uh, product, uh, company ceos and all why i am able to get it because whenever i share something or if they are watching my specific videos they are able to understand what kind of things i am actually developing and they really want those same use cases to be implemented in their company itself so unless and until you don't share that work people will never know about you right and probably i i can just say that from past 5 years i'm regularly doing this anything that i develop any projects that i develop any video that i share in youtube channel which is a kind of end to end projects i make sure that i keep on sharing them in linkedin and other social media platforms so that people get to know that right and in linkedin is the best platform why because people like us will only be there who will be interested in different different fields and one specific person they find out he or she will definitely reach out to you and ask you suggestion how you can probably implement and that is how once you grow this kind of connection trust me not one or two work you will be getting you'll get multiple works at the end of the day you really need to hire multiple teams to handle all those kind of work right yes uh, there are scope guys right and they are companies who definitely require a lot of help i'll be talking about multiple companies recently just last month also i got i got one I, obviously i got one opportunity from one of the company where they were saying hey come and please implement this okay we are going to even hire you for the full time but again i said that i'm not going to work as an employee because i'm building something i'm planning to build something as i go ahead you know and that is already there in the pipeline uh what i'm actually planning it right and later on i may hire many people for that also but initially since this is in the initial stages i'm going to invest money in that right so i'll be making sure that with a small team we'll try to build that mvp product and then we'll go out building it much a better product itself but yes wait uh it will be announced in front of you and then we will definitely make sure that we'll also hire more people for that right so all those things are there in the pipeline so please do not hesitate to share you know unless and until you don't keep on sharing things you really uh, you, you will not get any kind of clients and all you may be thinking hey krish we have to probably go into that upland strat uh, upwork platform or freelance platform no the best platform is linkedin where you will be getting the right kind of audience over there right now coming to the third and the most important thing is making yourself regularly updated with new things that are coming in the market and you really need to be in the like tip of your toe right whatever new things are probably coming up go ahead and implement it if you see in my channel every new things that are probably coming up in the market i'm making sure that i make a dedicated video for them even though it takes some amount of time even though uh, i do not have a time for doing multiple things but i'll always make sure that i keep a scope of things that i really want to do it right and uh, that is how i keep on exploring things and i go ahead and upload this particular videos right so you need to make yourself updated because tomorrow if the client asks for any kind of suggestion you will be able to provide them suggestion because you are already doing that specific work right so these are the three most important points that you really need to follow and let me tell you guys freelancing work or consultant work are are, are increasing and increasing a lot right now even in the us market people are getting hired from india itself as a remote job developer right they're getting it directly because they don't even have to go to us just remotely they are able to work from india itself right uh yes this was it for my side i hope you like this particular video i will see you all in the next video thank you take care bye bye